Welcome back to my channel guys. Today we are cooking goat curry. Goat curry. Curry goat. Goat curry. Curry goat. Okay, somebody mentioned to me in my last video, Abby, you should do a cooking and your husband rate it. And I'm like, my husband pretty much tried all Nigerian food and he knows how it tastes. So, and plus, it's going to give me like, you know, 100% anyway, because he knows I know how to cook all this food. So how about I challenge myself? Let me challenge myself and cook something that he has never tried from another tribe and he will actually like it. You know what I mean? So I decided to cook goat curry. Is it goat curry or curry goat? It doesn't matter. So we are going to be cooking curry goat. Curry goat. All my Caribbean sisters. Sorry, my kids are in the background. I told them to be quiet for you know kids. So um, I am going to be cooking curry goat and hopefully my husband will like it and he will not hate it for us to like actually because every time i'd be like oh babe can we go to like restaurant caribbean restaurants you eat he's like i've never tried your food you know there's always a first time but i'm very happy that i'm gonna be cooking him and i, I hope he likes it so today um i want to invite all of you guys to join me school together let's have fun together and all my caribbean sisters you guys are also there to join even though you can try but you're also watching me still leave a comment and tell me what i do wrong because it's not my you know it's not my cultural food it's not for my country food so i'm sure they still cook curry goats in nigeria i'm sure they do but like i've never we, we don't cook it like that we cook it but we don't cook it like the way you guys cook it so all the indians all the caribbeans that actually are pro in this all of you guys are here to also judge me and yeah but anyways if you're new to my channel my name is abby and please subscribe please subscribe click subscribe you know support your sister because we are here to support each other we are here to like you know motivate each other my kids are like have an argument Leila Malika be quiet I'm almost done we are here to motivate each other so um yeah make sure you subscribe check out my other channels and also my kids channel my vlog channel user channel please I'm gonna leave it in the comment section support us and you guys like in my outfit it says blessed to be a mom and blessed to be a daughter something like that um yeah that's what i'm wearing i'm wearing my kimono on top and we're gonna be cooking cooking i'm so excited Even my husband loves this food and with that being said let's jump into this cooking before we jump into it i'm gonna be showing you guys this new pot that i got sorry my son just left outside so that's why this door just went i got this new pot from where i got i'm gonna be showing you guys all the spice that i'm gonna be using and all the ingredients so um I got this new pot because one of my subscribers says uh, one of the pot that I used has a scratch in, in it so it's not hygienic to use it so I thought about that and, and I think she was she, she's right and so I went to pick up new brand new pots today what's up hi yeah mama so funny so you need scissors or knife which one I'm gonna be washing this now. It's a nice pot, you know, and then it's made in Dubai. So we're gonna be cooking the curry goat in here. I have my cor I'm sorry, I have my goat here. I'm gonna rewash it again because it was frozen. That's why it doesn't look like it's fresh, but it's actually fresh. It's fresh, you know. I told you guys last time. I went to a washer shop to buy the whole meat. So yeah, and take this out. Girls, you can talk now, but like don't make too much loud noise, okay, please. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna be using for my curry goat. Other things I'm gonna be there's not a lot of stuff that I'm gonna be using for the curry goat. It's, it's not like a lot of ingredients. Sorry, just wanna like yes. So because I'm gonna be making some veggies on the side for it, I'm gonna be making um carrots and broccoli as my veggies. And for my curry goat, where I tried it, the put potato in it, and I think you don't have to, I think it's optional. Correct me if I'm wrong. Not everybody, not everybody put potatoes in it so but i want to put potatoes in it you know everything in one everything in one everything in one one pot curry goat maybe we should call it one pot curry goat this spice uh where i went to get the spice the stuff the guy told me this is like the best curry spice for goats like you can see the goats here he told me he's also uh west indies and he told me like to use this this is the best uh, spice instead of just like keep going and putting all different kind of spice in it like use this I, I have like curry but it says this is actually um the spice that you use for the curry goat all this and this is all you need um i would the name is it's called easy mix and it's called randuhini randuhini 
Razala masala. Razala masala. I'm not sure. But it's already in like some powder dish stuff. And anyways, um, yeah, this is what we're gonna be using. Um, yeah, so let's get started because it's one thing I like about curry goat is it doesn't like you know how we prepare we marinate and we cook the meat. Everything is just in one pot, which is amazing. I don't have to worry about like, you know, frying the meat or you can fry the meat if you want, but I'm not gonna be frying the meat. I'm just gonna show you guys. I'm just gonna be quiet. I'm just gonna be quiet because all of the Caribbeans and Indians gonna watch me right now be like, ah, just get to the point. So let's get in there. So first I'm gonna wash my pot. This pot that I just got and I showed you guys. I'm gonna wash it. And yo guys, I have been up and about all day. My energy right now, it's a force. I cannot believe it. Oh yeah, I didn't even show you my blister. I have a blister at the corner of my lips, which is from, I think it's called Fever Blister. Somebody actually told me the name, the English name on Instagram. And said, Abby, you have a Fever Blister. I was like, wow, that's what it's called. I said to fight more than like 50 times a day. My two kids, they're always arguing, fighting, screaming, internet. It's all gone now. It's all fine now for another next 10, 15 minutes. Okay guys, so I'm gonna wash my goat meat. And let's get started. Okay, Sadam, look here. My, husband, my daughter wanna tell you something. Yeah. Okay, so like guys, She's been craving for this kind of food. Mm. She's been craving for like, like the past two weeks. I've been craving for it, right? Yes. And I talked about it all the time, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Thanks, Mama. You are amazing, daughter. Thank I, you for that. I know. You're a wonderful, wonderful, gorgeously made daughter of mine. Right? Are you? Yes, you are. And I love you. I love you, Mommy Ka. So I'm gonna slice some onions and, you know, just chop my onions in it. And they go. I love how my daughter just stand, every time I'm cooking, she just stand there and watches me. I know you're gonna be a great cook like mama, and I'm so, so proud of you, sunshine. Yeah, so anyways, I'm putting the onions in the goats right now, and what else, where's my spice? Okay, like I said, like I said, like I said, um, usually you put curry, or spice, even sometimes cinnamon in your goat, but the guy promised me this is all I need which I think makes it even more easier for me to be adding too much stuff in it. It smells so good. So, yes, come smell it. Come. My daughter wanna smell it. And you guys are not seeing me. This is to Zoom. And when I'm editing it, I get mad at myself. I'm like, why, did I, why didn't I put it back so you guys can even see me better? So, I had to move the camera back so my face wasn't showing. Okay guys, so I'm gonna pull my curry now and I'm gonna be using two Teaspoon. Mm. Yeah, I think this should be good. I don't want to put too much in there with the mom because the down wasn't fully cooked. Okay. I'm hoping I don't have to use it all. So now, where's the box that just came out? Okay, I'll fix that later. So now I'm gonna add some a little bit of uh, grounded pepper, just a little bit. You try to say you use a uh, scotch bennet pepper. Scotch pepper. I just want to use the grounded pepper, which is like um, one teaspoon, and that's it because my kid doesn't like pepper. So that's all we're gonna be using in there. And I want to add some thyme, fresh thyme. This one is fresh thyme that user got me. You know, I'm gonna add some there. Mmm, mmm. Actually, let me mix it because I didn't mix it in. Let me mix it in. Let me mix it in. Okay, so I'm gonna mix it in. Mmm. 
I almost, I almost forgot my scallions. I almost forgot my green onions. Um, so I'm gonna add some scallions. Oh my gosh, I'm like, oh my gosh, something is missing. Okay, so I'm gonna chop some couple scallions in there, which is my green onions, and it's so nice and fresh. Hang on. I like to cut my scallions in angle, like. It looks like it doesn't look around, it's just an angle, you know, chop, chop, chop. And yeah, so I added the scallions in there. So now I can mix it in. Oh yeah, I need to add salt and pepper. And before I forgot, I'm gonna add my pepper and salt. Please girls, so I'm gonna add some pepper. Black pepper, it's optional. It just boosts the taste. And I'm gonna add some salt. Yeah. And I'm gonna mix it in. Mix it in, mix it in, mix it in, mix it in, mix it in. And I, I don't know, it's not even about, cause it's curry. I like to mix in my ingredient very, very well, thoroughly, in my meat. So now I'm gonna be adding some water into it. So the water is gonna not too much, but like kind of like cover it. Yeah. There we go. Where is all my Caribbean sisters? Where is all my Caribbean sisters? Where is all my Caribbean sisters? Sisters, sisters. My kids are like, mom, what are you doing? Um, yeah, so this is what it looks like. No, let me show you guys well. So yeah, I'm gonna go put this on a, on a high heat. That's all we need. Where is my cover? Okay, so we're gonna cover this now and let it cook. So I'm gonna put away stuff that I use. My daughter was like, are we just gonna eat that alone? Like we're just gonna eat that because they never tried the goat's curry before. And I was like, we're gonna, calm down, honey, I got this. We're gonna eat some rice with it, some nice white rice with it, okay? Calm down, I got it. Oh, use, use ra. I don't got some rough ones, see you cooking, yeah? so don't worry any time. Yeah, thanks. Okay. Um, so I'm going to put it with the stuff that I use. Let's put it with the stuff that I use. And time will go in the fridge. Okay, guys. Let me put this here. I, you're going to pardon me, guys, because this is my first time cooking this, okay? Mistakes are allowed, okay? As, not, as long as you acknowledge it. Okay, so... I forgot to put ginger, fresh ginger and garlic. So I'm gonna shave some in there now. The food hasn't even started cooking yet. So now I'm gonna shave my ginger. Well, grate it, not shave it, grate it. I keep saying shave all the time. Um, I'm gonna peel my ginger skin really quick. I'm using my spoon, so you don't take too much of uh, good stuff out of from the ginger. So I'm just using my spoon. It's better when you use knife. You just when you use knife, you just take out more. But when you use spoon, it's like it's pulling it off. You know, just pulling out the skin. I have this leftover hot scotch pepper. It's got scotch belly pepper, I believe. I'm not gonna chop it. I'm just gonna like drop this half in there because if I chop it, my kids might bite it and they might go crazy. So I'm just gonna, it's half a scotch bed and pepper, so I'm just gonna drop it in there. I'm gonna rinse it because it came out from my freezer and drop it in there. And I think I got everything in there. Leave a comment if you think there's something that I need to add. Leave a comment below. And yeah, I'm gonna clean up now.
On my potato, I try not to use too much stuff. I try to wash and reuse what I what I used all the time. Just reuse them instead of like getting new stuff all the time because it's just gonna like be too much to wash. So um, I'm getting my potato. Oh, my potato yes. Sorry about this. You know, if you're a mom, you understand, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are mom, and some of you guys that are not mom still understand. Um, yes. So I am going to be peeling, peeling my potato. I don't have potato peeler, so I'm using my knife. Just take the skin out. I don't know. I want to add a little bit of oil in it. Just a little bit. Just to bring the taste. About two tablespoons of oil. So I'm going to add it in there. So you just not, it's not just spice. So I'll just add it in there. Yeah, so that's about two tablespoons of oil. And I'm going to continue with my potato. So I'm going to rinse this now. Just wash it, you know. Hey guys, um, let me put this in because I'm done with it. I'm gonna be peeling my carrots. I don't have carrot peeler to. Ah, uh, I used to have them, but I don't know what happened to them. So this carrot, are like the the heirloom. How do you say heirloom carrot? These are the heirloom carrots. I think I'm saying it right. Okay, I want to show you guys the curry. Let me bring the light too so it's more closer. Perfect. See, it's dark outside now. So, okay, let's see how the curry is doing.
Wow. Wow. Let me show you guys better. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. You hungry, sunshine? Okay. Um, yeah. I'll say, yeah, it's ready for me to put my potato in there. So, I'm putting my potato in there. <coughs> yeah? Is there any cup? Any what? Any cup? Yeah, you need a cup, Mama? Yeah, I need a cup. Any Yeah. And I'm gonna leave these to cook. So the next 10 minutes, they should be ready. I'm gonna cover it now. So I'm gonna show you guys when it's ready. I'm gonna bring this back again and show you guys. Okay, so my rice is boiling. I'm gonna add some salt to my rice. I'm gonna add a little bit of, oh actually I'm gonna add some salt in my veggie water and I'm gonna add water in my veggie water too, just a little bit, like a tablespoon, you know. And um, I forgot to add salt in the water, so I'm gonna add salt in my veggie water. So the water is boiling, let me cover the rice because it's washing. The water is boiling for the veggies now, so I'm gonna throw let me actually show you guys because some of you guys actually want to see so the water is boiling easy way to make veggies especially like hot veggies like this let the water boil oh I put some salt let me put some black pepper too a little bit of black pepper it just make it nice and tasty so yeah I'm gonna throw my veggies in there now you know instead of like stir fry all the time you can still stir fry these after if you want if you don't mind the oil just too much oil I don't like it so this is just perfect and yeah and the rice already added uh, the salt and the oil in there so it should be good so now I'm gonna put this back and quickly clean up my stuff that I used Okay, it's about 10 minutes now. I'm gonna check all my goat meat. Whoa, and wow, Leila, are you excited? Are you excited for this? We be ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I bleed too much. Sorry, guys. My husband just got home. Hi, babe. You okay? For your water. Let's get your reaction on camera. Let's get your reaction on camera. Well, first, welcome back. Okay, so. No, honestly, I'm cooking a Caribbean food today. Caribbean? Caribbean. Okay. Caribbean, and you're going to rate my cooking. I told you, right? Earlier. That's how far I, I taste it. That's how I eat it. Babe, but you like spicy, right? You like Uta. Yeah. Right, Uta. I love spices. Yeah. I'm okay. a typical African. You're a typical African, but this one is Caribbean food. So you're gonna rate my outfit. Babe, come come smell it. Come in the kitchen. Come smell it. Come smell it. It's already a little Oh, really? Yeah. It smells like outside too? Yeah. yeah. I'm serious. I can smell the outside. Kilo, kilo. Like, what are you smelling? I can smell the, 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 the beef. Like, like, like beef? Goat. Yeah, goat. Like yeah, it's goat. It's goat curry. curry. Yes. Uh -huh. Babe, you're right. You're right. You're right. Okay, so, um, my veggie is ready. I'm gonna drain it. Ready, ready. How was work? Oh, I'm in line. Yeah? I'm so, because I just drained the, uh, 
if they get from hot, I'm gonna turn my cold water on it right away so it doesn't continue cooking. That's why some veggies become very soggy because when you, when you take them out and you just leave it in, just in the pot, it continues to cook because they're so hot. And because they're very delicate, they will continue to cook and it will become mushy and soggy, so you don't want that. So right away, always put cold water on your veggie. It is nice and nice and crispy, well cooked. So yeah. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Clean it here. It's ready anyway, so I'm just leaving it in the um, thing. Okay, so now my curry is ready. I'm gonna turn this off. Oh, let me transfer these. So we're just waiting for the rice. Oh, this is not too hot. We're just waiting for the rice to be ready and I can serve dinner. Ouch. This is so hot. Oh my god, why? Perfect. So the rice should be ready in the next 10 minutes. I'm just adding a little water to cook it more. Okay guys, my curry goat is ready. Just gonna show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm still gonna bring out the camera to show you guys better. But yeah, but I gotta get my thumbnail. So I don't know, my thumbnail is always random somehow. But yeah, I need to get my thumbnail so Okay, so let me get my paper towel because it's ready. It's what I do all the time. I get a paper towel. And I'm gonna bring my curry here. And my rice is also ready. So I'm gonna be serving them. And I have my veggie. So I'm gonna serve my husband and I'm gonna show you my honest clip of him trying this and if he likes it yes so yeah i want to serve it but first i need to take the camera down so i can take a good picture of this first okay okay let me take this back so i can get like a nice picture okay so this is what it looks like yes that's what it looks like okay i need to mix it in you know okay this is my curry <coughs> excuse me sorry guys Oh, it's a little spicy. So this is what it looks like. And the taste, I feel like the taste is everything. And this thing that you're looking at is just the time, okay? The time, the fresh time. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And my white jasmine rice, my veggies. Okay, um, now I just finished, my face is not showing. I just finished um, serving my husband. This is his food, this is his food. So he's gonna be rating my first ever Caribbean, well, I keep saying Caribbean, well, good. What is it? Well, like I'm recording, oh my God. My first goat uh, curry ever. It's gonna, well, first time trying Caribbean food or Indian food, West Indies, whatever. Um, yeah, so he's gonna be rating this. Hopefully I pass, you know. So, babe, Malika, babe, I'm gonna get you a fork. Okay, uh, I need to get your fork. Okay, I need to put this back a little bit. I think it's just too, it's too zoomed. Wow. Okay, let me get your fork. Let me get your fork and a glass cup. Okay. So, ah, uh, I just want this to be like, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's the color of the food, babe. Okay, let me get you. Monica, I'm gonna serve you, okay? Give me one second, mama. Let me get you a cup. Oh, I need to raise this cup. It doesn't look right. Wait, I need to get your reaction. Well, start eating. That's okay. <laughs> I need, honestly, like, I need your honest opinion. I need your honest, honest opinion. You don't have to like tell me, oh, if it doesn't taste good, just say. Like, don't don't cover anything for me. Just tell me the truth. Second bite. Mommy, my heart is too wet. Third bite. <laughs> Let me. Uh -oh. Babe, you're actually eating it. You're not saying anything. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Mommy, what is that? That's um for punch. Mm -hmm. Okay, 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 okay. 
Okay, tell me. Be honest. I need to like move this camera this way. Ah. Well, I don't want to be too um, exaggerating or anything. Okay. To be factual. Yeah. We have to rate things. Yeah. At the rate of 10, mm -hmm. I will give you 11 of 10. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were gonna say it. <laughs> I'm serious. Seriously? I'm serious. No. For real. To me, this is kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I like mm -hmm. I like the spicy aspect of it. Oh yeah. uh, babe, serious, like you know, like oh wow. And is this your first time trying Caribbean food? My first time I ever. Right. But I love this. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm serious. Oh my god, use rap! Wow, Daddy give me 11 out of 10. I've got 11 out of 10. Okay, guys, yes, honey. Okay, I'm gonna start you now. First time food. Yeah, first time trying Caribbean food. Actually, this is like my family first time trying Caribbean food. So, you know, I needed my husband's opinion because somebody make a suggestion video that Abby, you need to make um, husband rate my food. And I feel like that's cool. So, I've never tried Caribbean food. Why not just try it? And yo, 11 out of 10. Mm. 11 out of 10. This is good. Oh my god. So I can take you out to like a Caribbean restaurant so we can go have some curry sometimes. I think I'm a good cook. Okay, I'm gonna mm. I'm gonna serve you. Anyway, let me end this vlog because it's gonna be so long. Okay, I am oh my battery is blinking too. Okay, I'm on top of the world right now. I need to like end this vlog right now. Please make sure you subscribe if you enjoyed today's video. I am so blessed and so happy. <laughs> Subscribe and I will catch you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Bye. Oh my god.